my friend and I are saying hello to you. So hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, this is on the menu. Oftentimes, I go shopping and I buy watermelon, we are not able to use it until it goes bad. Not anymore. I'll show you three ways you can use your watermelon and I'll show you three ways you can find out that the watermelon you're buying is ripe. So, thank you, stick with me and I'll show you. And thank you to all my subscribers. If you are considering subscribing, please do so. Share my videos and I'll see. So this is my little one trying to find out if the watermelon is ripe. Now I am trying so hard to get a slice of it. This is a big one, so if you have a sharp knife, use it and get a slice of it finally i did it yay now look at the inside oh beautiful you're using it is right you just have to make sure that the side that was lying on the floor is really yellow just like you see here very yellow again the side that connects to the stem you also have to make sure this side is not green you hear a hollow sound like I don't know if you can hear you hear that hollow sound and then you know that your watermelon is very ripe so one look at the stem that connects to the watermelon if it is brown you know it's ripe and then the part that was lying on the floor you have to make sure is yellow just like you see here and also you have to knock on it if it is hollow then you know your watermelon is ripe now we have a slice of the watermelon i'm going to show you how you can get a perfect triangular shape out of it so just do it like you see me doing look for the pointy part and then slice it through the the skin just like so now I'll show you how it looks like. Now this is how it looks like, a perfect triangle. If you think this is too thick for you, you can also do half an inch or even a quarter of an inch will be perfect. My kids call this one watermelon cheese. <laughs> Just look at that, nice one. This one is for my mouth. <laughs> I'm trying to get another slice so I can show you how to make squares out of your watermelon. So just look at what I'm doing. We are just peeling, take the skin off and then I'll show you how to cut it. Today my camera is not helping but I know you get a hang of it. So now that you have it ready, you're just going to cut it lengthwise from the top to the bottom, top to the bottom, top to the bottom. Just be careful with your knife. Like I said, if you think this is too big for you, you can also cut it um, little, like smaller cubes. Now turn your cutting board and then you cut it crosswise like you see me doing. Just like that. Just be careful guys. Now they are done. This is how it looks like. Let's have a bite. Oh my goodness, this is so juicy and so sweet. Now I'll show you how I make salad out of it. Now that your cubes are ready, just add as much as you want. And then you're going to add cucumber to it. This is just regular cucumber that I deceded. You can also use English cucumber. And this is mint. We want that minty flavor. Just add that one. <laughs> now I'll also show you just a simple dressing that will go well with the salad, okay? So I have olive oil in the cup and I'm adding lemon juice. I'll 
I am also going to add some pepper. This is black pepper. If you don't have black, you can use white. I'm also going to add salt. This is sea salt. Use any salt of your choice. But because we are going to add cheese, you got to be careful with the amount of salt that you use. And this is celery seeds. You don't have to add this, but to be frank with you, this is a killer. I have it home, so I'm going to use it. Now your dressing is ready. So this is the feta cheese. I'm just going to sprinkle a little bit on top. And you have your refreshing watermelon salad. If you don't have lemon, you can also use vinegar. But lemon gives it that lemony, citrusy, refreshing summer vibe, right? So do that one. This one is good. It's really good, guys. This salad is as good as it. Enjoy. You can as well add red onions. Now, just serve it. You have this perfect gorgeous watermelon salad enjoy y'all if you like what you've seen so far just give your girl a thumbs up share my videos and also subscribe okay thank you so this is all done I'm gonna be showing you how I make this beautiful drink right here. I know you are very thirsty for this drink. So let's get started, okay? I've got my big old blender here and I have six cups of watermelon in there. And to that, I'm adding this pinch of ginger. To me, it's pinch. It is optional though. And a teaspoon of sugar. You don't have to. Now give it a blend. If you don't mind the pop, you can use this big strainer to strain your juice, like that one. Or you can also use this very fine strainer to strain. Now strain and chill in the refrigerator for at least an hour. So mine has been there for an hour now. I'm just adding some ice to the glass and I'm gonna be adding my juice. Oh my goodness the color is beautiful the drink is amazing with the pinch of ginger in there oh my goodness so beautiful now enjoy I'll show you how I make a margarita out of this so stay tuned So your juice is ready and all that you need to do is to add a few ingredients. This is a lemon and I want it to release its juices, that's, that's what I'm doing right now. It's optional. I didn't have lime home, if you do, use lime instead. I'm just using half of it. So squeeze the juice into your shaker bottle, add your ice, as much as you want. Add your juice and also add your favorite tequila I did not have any tequila home so I am using vodka just about an ounce of it nothing more this is the best but we are saving it for the last this 
is not kids friendly please guys for adults only these are margarita glasses i'm just squeezing a little bit of lemon juice on there and then i'll dip it into my granulated sugar just like that your gorgeous rim glass is ready i'll show you one more time just like so and you are done you do not need to have expensive things for you to get whatever you want use whatever you have in your pantry and have yourself a beautiful drink and enjoy the summer okay go grab yourself a watermelon and don't let it go waste this is the season for watermelon so i'll see you next time in my next video stay safe i love you and maybe invite me over for lunch or dinner Thanks. Bye.